What are the chances that a sea turtle is a what else? <laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Metal World. Thank you for joining me today, and I am fired up about litter because I hate it. I hate when people tr throw trash everywhere in litter. It's just disgusting. I understand if something blows out of your car accidentally. Oops. Okay, it happens. But if you throw something out of your car or you do like these people did at Chick-fil-A where they just left an entire table worth of trash on your table, we got no room for you, okay? If you did that, if you did this right here, left all that trash right there, I got a message for you. Castrate yourself. If you're a girl, get spayed, neutered, whatever it is Bob Barker used to say, whichever one applies to you because we have no need for people like you anymore. We've We've, we've reached the max. Here's how many we need. We got this many, okay? So stop making those people. In fact, you can go <laughs> get rid of yourself because those people don't need to be around. We've got enough people like that, okay? We've reached the limit. So not only that, the same time I went to Chick-fil-A, I went into the bathroom and I saw this. Yes, that is paper towels all over the floor. I wouldn't be surprised. I would bet most of my money that the same person who left their trash at that table is the same person who went <laughs> and threw it on the floor. Hey man, there's a trash can right there for a reason. It's right below where you get the paper towels. You can just go <laughs> dry your hands, throw it in there. But no, this person went da, 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 da. we don't need that person anymore. People, persons, whatever it might be. And this is not to brag about me, okay? This is just to motivate you to not do that. Or if you do do that, what I did, how much I hate it, I took a clean paper towel, put it in my hand, can, 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 threw all that in the trash can. And then when I got done with my food, I was sitting right there and I saw a couple people walk by and I saw her one girl go, ah, oh, I hate when people do that. I'm with you, sister, okay? Sister who works at, or shops definitely at, at Hot Topic, wearing your Slipknot shirt. We have that bond, okay? We're together on that situation. So once again, I cleaned up the mess in the trash can, in the bathroom, threw all that in the trash can, not too hard. And I got done with my Chick-fil-A, emptied out my bag in the trash can like a normal upright citizen would do. And upstanding citizen, upright citizen brigade is something different. Uh, I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. So I got all that, put all the trash in there and then threw it away. Did I have to? No. Was I supposed to? No. But should I? Yes, because I'm a decent person. I'm not a great person. I'm a eh, person. But even I know that you shouldn't be littering and leaving trash everywhere because then it looks disgusting and then you kill sea turtles. Now, get me, don't get me wrong. I'm not one of those crazy people who think we need to use paper straws. That's the worst invention and idea I ever heard in my entire life. You ever used a paper straw? You can't, okay? Have you ever tried to, to soak up something with paper or suck it up? You can't because it's paper. I know it lasts for a little bit, but hey man, I don't want to drink my frozen drink within five seconds of getting a <laughs> oh, brain freeze. Oh God, what happened? Yeah, because my paper straw's gonna go away. No, plastic's the answer. I wouldn't be surprised if that video with the turtle was fake in the stage and they took a turtle and then, <laughs> and they go, oh my gosh, we, we had to pull this straw out of his nose. What are the chances that a sea turtle's what else? <laughs> a bajillion to one, okay? That's that's not plausible. It's, it's, it's so, that 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 turtle should have got a scratcher or a lottery ticket right after that with, in his nose and they pull it out and go, no, lottery ticket. Okay, and then, because he's going to win a lottery because he's got the greatest odds on planet Earth because that doesn't happen, okay? If you look at the data and see how many straws make up how much garbage, it's this much compared to this much of trash in the ocean. So, I'm not pushing that agenda. And then today, I went to Chick-fil-A, almost got in a fight with some people because I was sitting there eating my food, enjoying my Chick-fil-A like one would do. And there was a table of kids. I call them kids. I'm 38 now. There's the guy who works at Chick-fil-A and he calls me Mr. Adam. I'm like, oh God, I'm not Mr. Adam. I'm just Adam. I'm not a Mr. But so I don't know how old these kids were. They were younger than me, for sure. I would guess between 16 and 19, but with kids these days and people these days, I don't know how old anybody is at all, like at all. There are girls who are 16 who look like they're 35 and girls who are 40 who look like they're 18. So I'm just like, uh, can I legally be talking to you at all? Like, I, I'm not gonna message you because then I'm definitely going to jail. So it's, oh, oh okay, oh, handcuffs, okay. Well, I'm sorry. Uh, apologies and then taken off to jail but the kids were sitting there 
just doing whatever they do. I mean, I was a young kid at one point in time, and you're just kind of, ooh, let's have fun, blah, blah, blah. And so I was sitting there eating my food once again, enjoying it because Chick-fil-A is delicious. They're not a sponsor. They should be. And all of a sudden I heard, bam! I'm like, whatever, just kids doing whatever. I figured he threw something like a, like a bag of trash into the trash can and then got it or something. I don't know. I just like, whatever. It doesn't apply to me. Keep your head down low. Just mind your own business. And all of a sudden I went, wham! Again, I'm like, what the heck are they doing? And they started laughing. Ha, ha, ha. I turn around and look. There's Chick-fil-A sauce all over the trash can. It didn't just magically get there. Just, la, 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 la. there's no Chick-fil-A sauce fair that just, oops, I sprinkled it all over the trash can. I got it. No. So I put two and two together. Oh, these kids were throwing uh, Chick-fil-A sauce in the trash can. And the second one, he missed. And they're all, ha, 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 laughing. And, oh, look what Billy did. I'm guessing his name. I don't know what his name was. His name could be Johnny. And so they started pulling their backpacks on, getting ready to leave. And like, hey, who's going to clean that mess up? And I, ah, uh, it got real quiet. My buddy said he was just like, uh-oh. He didn't know what was going to happen. He's like, is he about to fight all these kids right now? Probably not going to happen. I wasn't going to uh, antagonize these kids. But, I mean, I'm not going to get molly whopped by a bunch of little kids. No, I watch enough wrestling in UFC. If someone kid try to grab me, good night. Good night. Just six kids, good night. And they come, where's Johnny and Billy and Michael and, and, and Devin? They're asleep at Chick-fil-A. You can pick them up in about mm, 20 minutes when they wake up. But luckily it didn't come to that. But it's the one kid was like, uh, we don't have any napkins. Like, uh, they have napkins inside. And they're like, uh, okay. And they sent the smallest one inside. And I was like, hey, just be respectful. And they're like, uh, and they all got on their phones like little, little kids do this. Um, uh, I hope he doesn't say anything else. Oh God, please don't kill us. I just was, I don't even know him. I just, we have second semester together, but it's even a Zoom class. I've never, this is my first time meeting him. Please don't kill me. The kid came back finally, cleaned it up, and I was like, thank you. And they didn't say anything, and they walked off. I guarantee you. And they're like, who oh, that old guy, who do you think he is? We should have beat him up. All right. All right. Bring it. I haven't been in a fight in a long time. I'm more than happy to beat up six people. Oh, gosh. But luckily, it didn't come to that. But my friend, once again, he was a little nervous. He's shorter than I am. He's like... 60, no, he's like 50 something. I apologize. I don't know people's ages. I already told you that. And he was just kind of like, oh no, what's going to happen? I didn't think anything was going to happen. If it was been a bunch of thugs or whatever, like hard looking people, I would have just been like, <whistles> but these are little twerps. Hopefully they learn respect. Like, hey, let's not do that. Cause maybe, maybe something we'll do it to the wrong person and then they'll kick our butts. But I wasn't about to do that. Uh, so my point is if you litter, don't do it. If you don't litter, keep not doing it. Um, that is it. Hope everybody enjoyed this video. Hope you learned something. Don't forget to like this video. Comment below, especially if you've got any other situations similar to that one. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and all that good happy stuff. And from the bottom of my heart, my 38-year-old heart, I do appreciate it. And until next time, peace.